Hey there YouTubers, I'm back for System Test 6. As you might be able to tell, the system has been taken out of the house. Um, the reasoning for this is because we're about to do renovations and my parents don't want the fire alarm system in the new house because I'll be taking it with me when I leave, um, which is probably going to be relatively soon. So I've put it all back on this display board. Um, I've laid it out slightly different. So I've got the free call points down the bottom. Um, snap glaze, which means they're resettable. My four 2151 BPI smoke detectors there. Two heat detectors. The fire alarm panel, which I should should have reset before the video. Do that now. Okay. We've got the four 100 volt speakers there. <clears throat> my exit sign. My emergency light. If I just quickly get in there. I'll see that it's working. And my two Spectra Alert Classic strobes. A 75 Candela with red um, red visors on them. Okay, so we will start the system test. Hmm, what are we going to set off? I think we'll set off one of the smoke detectors with a magnet. Okay. <coughs> Conveniently have my magnet up to the bottom of my smoke test fluid. Okay, here we go. Alright, that's alarm verification there. Should be back up. No, soon. There you go. Okay, now we'll reset the panel. Okay. Now, I want to show you a cool function of this um, panel quickly. If I just get my keys. Sorry about the shaky video. I really need to get a tripod. Um, You'll see that little yellow LED there. If I disconnect the battery, there you go. You'll see that this decodes fault so you can tell exactly what's going on. So you can see it's a long flash on two, so that means it's a battery. If I reconnect this, It will go back to normal on the panel, but it's logged in there until you reset it next. So I thought that was pretty cool. Um, all right, we'll test a manual call point. Uh, this one here. Oh, it hadn't finished resetting. Probably should wait this time. Okay, now we'll do it. Okay, so that concludes that test, but I have a surprise for you. You'll see that on the ground I have some more manual call points if it will focus. It's pretty nasty. Come on. Anyway, I've got two Series 65 smoke detectors 
from Gamewell, I think it is. Um, they're rebranded in New Zealand to Ampac, but I know they're... I'm not sure who actually makes them. Uh, if you know, leave that in the comments. I've got a manual core point there, and a different type there, um, along with a 100 volt speaker. And it's not hooked up to this system, so what could it be hooked up to? Look at that. That is my new panel. It is an 8 zone panel. Um, so there's all the 8 zones there. I've got every single one to, um, not in use except zone 1. <clears throat> the good thing about this panel one like my other one is it's got a lot of it's got an auxiliary relay it's got a sprinkler input it's got fire defect relays um, two separate bell outputs for higher current five amps I think so it's just all around a lot better and you can put mimic displays in which I will be getting so that'll be cool all right so without further ado let's set off this side of the system um, Okay, we'll do this one first. As you can see, using this module here, I have actually hooked the two panels together. So I will turn off the auxiliary relay now. And we'll just set this one off, um, reset it first. Just wait for it to start up. Okay, it's going through all the zones, making sure there's no trouble. And there's a battery trouble because I don't have a battery for it yet, so it's gonna go into trouble eventually. Oh, that's probably why it's not doing that yet. Always forget to reset the call points. Okay. Right, this time we can do it. Okay, and I think we'll change the output on the... um. The voice evac. Um, D and E. D. N and E. There we go. Okay, that's a different tone now. All right, we'll set it off using this call point here. Okay, one last cool function I will show you is walk test. So what you do is you've got this button here, and you just hold it down, and then it goes into walk test mode, take it off isolate, and put it back on. Um, okay, that's good walk test. <clears throat> so we will set off this cool point. And it resets. Try this one. Yep. And now we'll try the smoke detector. But I will take it off walk test mode. So I got my trusty can of smoke here. Okay. I don't like using too much of this stuff, but unfortunately with these Gamewell smokes, it's the only way to set them off. They don't have a reed switch in them. Um, there we go. 
that's the false alarm prevention so we'll wait about 30 seconds and then we'll spray it again these are quite sensitive actually I probably won't need to spray anymore it should just go off in a few seconds we'll see might need a tiny bit more Okay, and that pretty much concludes System Test 6. I hope you enjoyed watching. Um, certainly do like this new panel a lot. But what I do need to do to it is get these holes um, drilled out properly and then put have them labelled um, and then put a map of, map of something on there. Um, but apart from that, it's a really cool system. And yeah, thanks for watching.